Hey, good morning, everyone. This is Midweek Wednesday Metal. Just something to embolden you through the rest of this week. Let's think about what God has been doing in our lives the last month, two months, maybe perhaps even the last year. So much has happened. Mark 2.22 says this, And no one puts new wine into old bottles. I don't know anything about winemaking. Apparently, Jesus did and knew that everyone else did in Jesus' day. And no man puts new wine into old bottles, or else the new wine will burst the bottles or burst the new wine skins, and the wine will be ruined, the wine will be spilled, and the bottles will be ruined. But new wine must be put in new wineskins. What's God been doing in your life? Do you remember uh, the toy Stretch Armstrong? You might remember that. It was this guy. He could be stretched in all contorted shapes. I uh, read this week he was filled with gelatinized corn syrup in case uh, some child stretched him too far and he ruptured and it wouldn't poison the children. But Stretch Armstrong, no matter what you did to him, he had returned to his normal shape. I guess unless you just tore him in two. And then you had gelatin uh, corn syrup all over the place. Well, I think these last months have been stretching us. If it hasn't been stretching you, I'm just wondering if you were paying attention to anything. And I'm just being honest. New wine belongs in new wineskins. What is Jesus doing in your life? Is your spiritual capacity changing in these days? Is your ability to recognize what God is doing in your life being recognized? Are you able to, to respond to that? Are you putting what God is giving you in a new wineskin? Uh, we're not going to go back to normal. There's a new normal. I don't know that I really like that phrase, but we're not going backwards, that's for sure. And yet God is still at work. New wine needs to be put in new wineskins. If you put new wine in a worn out, stretched wineskin, if you put what God is doing in your life now and you try to fit it into what God was doing in your life a year ago, something's going to break. Hear this song, Cloverton's Good Friends of Ours. They come from Manhattan, Kansas. We've had them in concert a number of times here. Listen to this song. They released it in 2017. It's called Wineskins. New wine in the old wine skins. Something breaks when nothing bends. There's trouble up ahead. I believe we as the body of Christ are going to be stretched even more than we have been. We're going to have to make some really tough decisions, I think, in the next months ahead. So I'm just challenging us. Are we putting our new experiences, the things that God has been teaching us, into our old paradigms? Because if we are, something's going to break. I think there's trouble up ahead. I really do. I'm praying for revival. I'm praying for breakthrough. But I'm not confident that things are going to get better. Now, I'm confident in the future. God holds the future. But I'm not confident in the immediate future. And I think that we need to be paying careful attention to what the Holy Spirit is doing. I think it's vitally important that every Christian begin to begin a, uh, a series of, of personal devotions where you're just solidifying your relationship with Jesus so that you are stretching yourself in preparation for what God wants to do in all of our lives. New wine, new revelation, new instructions belong in new wineskins or else we will be stretched and we will be burst. And such as in Stretch Armstrong, we'll have gelatinized corn syrup all over the place. But when a Christian bursts, 
when a Christian life explodes or implodes, either one, it's real, really, really devastating. So let's prepare ourselves for what God is going to be pouring into us in these next weeks and months ahead because he wants the church to be active. He wants the church to be visible. He wants our light to shine. As I said on Monday, that we would shine as bright lights in the midst of a crooked and perverse generation in which we live. So are you being stretched? Great. Just make sure that it's going into new wineskins. God bless you. This is Pastor Jeff Barclay, Midweek Wednesday Metal. If you want to talk to me further about the Lord Jesus Christ, contact me through our church's website, www.cclawrence.org. Have a great rest of this week.